Okay guys, another darts review. These are the Mark Walsh darts uh, from Target. And these are 26, see they're 26 gram. I'm sorry my um, camera's a little bit off. I think it might be the, I'm not exactly sure, but yeah, these are 26 gram. Uh, Mark Walls Target. These are ones I recently got today in the mail, and uh, this is what you get for your money. Uh, order from uh, Harrow's Darts Corner, which is the website I order them from. Uh, you get your uh, 20. This is a pamphlet that they got in the box that dimplicks like uh, the golf ball and everything. And, and uh, when you order from Target, you get some extra flights that they come with it, some extra shafts, truly a lovely little gift that they get for your money. Um, now these flights are actually pretty, pretty interesting. You can see there, there's a little hole, and that's actually for these here, these, these rings. Now there's a product that you can get, which is a hole puncher for your flights. Doesn't matter what flight, it could be pear, it could be kite shaped, you know, it, it just uh, any flight. And um, you make the punch and you put in one of these rings, and that way your flight never comes off, which is very good. I also ordered these Walshy, um, uh, these Walshy uh, flights, extra sets of them. Now, uh, we'll take a look at the darts. Okay, um... Peace out. And, uh, first impressions. Um... I like them. I, re I really do like them. I think the reason why I like them so much. It has... Right on the top there, you can't pick it out, but it says the target Walshy. I have no idea what's wrong with this camera. I'll have to figure that out. Um, a diamond type of grip, 26 gram, a very balanced dart with the traditional point you can see right there. The Walshy Flight. And I already tested these out earlier today um, before I did the review. Uh, they fly very well, very um, very good. I suppose you could say this is a traditional type of dart. Uh, it's not long and uh, or anything like that. It's not uh, like yours. Uh, I'll compare them to the Raymond Van Barneveld Phase One, I suppose you could say. Um, the barrel, obviously, you can see on the Mark Walsh uh, dart is fatter compared to the uh, Barney um, Unicorn. And it's a very well-balanced dart, a very good dart to hold in your hand with the diamond grip. I have to say that's... Um, I'll have to go see this a little 4-5 four, four grip, which is very good. So there's no way, especially the way I hold my dart, which is like this, there's no way that's going to slip out of your hands. Uh, as you can see right there, the spring in the uh, middle of the flight, once again, that won't take, that when you throw your dart, that will not uh, jump off the shaft and you won't lose your flight. I find this very good. Um, yeah, so... Uh, there you are, you have a full, uh, everything you need for a game of darts. These are the Mark Walsh uh, darts, 26 gram, and these are going to be the ones I'm going to be using from now on. I like these, uh, these are my favorite dart that ever came out because, um, for me, it, now obviously this is all opinionated, uh, opinion oriented. Um, I like these darts because I was never a fan, like, these type of darts here. This is the Terry Jenkins uh, 21 gram dart. I was never a fan of these, the long dart, because I always found them very, uh, very uh, unorthodox. I could never find my grip on them. I was never a big fan of these. 
Uh, also, uh, the very the ball bearing Peter Manley dart. I tried these for a while, and I did get a, a 180 with them. Uh, the ball, but I never could get used to holding them. Now, this right here is interesting. This right here is the Mark Walsh 22 gram stone grip. Uh, I got these for my birth, no, for Christmas actually. My parents bought them for me. And you can see the difference between the stone grip and the regular grip of the dart. Uh, it's different, very different. And um, I tried these for a while. I could never get used to them. So I decided to go for the regular Mark Walls dart and I found them very useful. Um, the reason why I like these, besides the fact that it has my name on it, Walshy, uh, obviously Mark Walsh and I are, um, are not related uh, or anything like that. He's in England and I'm. Newfoundland, but you know he's pro player and everything. But I like these for the fact that, yes, it has my name on it. So I am both Walshy on the my nickname, I suppose you could say, uh, on uh, the flight and the barrel. So what I like about them is um, I don't have to go out and get a custom made set of darts. Also, the shape of the barrel I always like too because, like I said, I was never a fan of these long, slender uh, darts, no matter what they were. So I was always a fan of the short barrels and the grip in the middle. Uh, I did very well with the John Lowe darts this weekend. Um, hang on now, I think I'll... Ah, here we go. These are the John Lowe dart compared to the Mark Walsh. They're very similar. Similar in shape, similar in size. Now these are 27 gram and these are 26. One gram don't make that much difference if you ask me, but um, I did very well with these for a lot of months. And I stuck with them for a while until I wanted to try new darts and really get the feel of it. But the Mark Walsh darts are the ones I'm going to stick with from now on for many different reasons. The barrel, the length, the size, the weight. And uh, I finally found the dart that's suitable for me. It's all about testing uh, which ones you, you really want. So these are the Mark Walsh darts. And I hope you enjoy this review. And leave your comments below. And uh, where I got these darts from are from Darts Corner. .co.uk. You can order them there through with Canadian dollars. And, uh, yep, have a good day. And always believe in the justice.